Pay attention to this clip and see if you can get the correct answer. We our scheduled programming to bring you this breaking news. We interrupt our scheduled programming to bring you this breaking news. Today we're going to be testing your English and grammar with news. If you haven't already watched our Learn English with News lessons, then be sure to watch them after this. So before we start, why not grab a pen and paper or find a way to keep track of how many answers you get correct. At the end of the lesson, we'll give you the results. Before we begin the test, each week we create lessons like this to help English learners like you understand fast speaking natives without getting lost, without missing the jokes and without needing subtitles. So why not join our community of over 5 million learners by hitting that subscribe button and bell down below so you never miss out on any of our new lessons. So for this test, you will answer 15 questions. They start out easy and then gradually increase in difficulty. Just a reminder that this is an informal test that does not replace a proper placement or proficiency test where all your language skills are assessed. However, it will give you a pretty good idea of what your English level is in terms of grammar and vocabulary. Are you ready? Let's go. News news, I'm here to help deliver it, not stop it. News is news, I'm here to help deliver it, not stop it. Yolanda's community was also recently by floods in New York. Yolanda's community was also hit recently by floods in New York. Good afternoon. In the last several minutes, KOB dozens of reports. Good afternoon. In the last several minutes, KOB has received dozens of reports. Turn on the TV. I'm the news, and it's not just a sketch of me. Turn on the TV. I'm on the news, and it's not just a sketch of me. The events known for spectacular and flamboyant costumes last year due to the pandemic. The event known for spectacular and flamboyant costumes was cancelled last year due to the pandemic. Prices are with no signs they're coming down soon. Prices are skyrocketing with no signs they're coming down soon. A judge in Los Angeles has now passed control of the estate to an accountant nominated by Britney Spears' lawyer, Sophie Long, LA. A judge in Los Angeles has now passed control of the estate to an accountant nominated by Britney Spears' lawyer. Sophie Long reports from LA. The Associated Press and others are reporting that he's expected to announce the decision a Friday deadline. That is despite his criticism of the 2015 nuclear deal. The Associated Press and others are reporting that he's expected to announce the decision by a Friday deadline. That is despite his criticism of the 2015 nuclear deal. A Facebook 
has told US lawmakers that she believes Facebook's products harm children, stoke division and weaken democracy. A Facebook whistleblower has told US lawmakers that she believes Facebook's products harm children, stoke division and weaken democracy. Facebook, you'll know, is also signed into many other apps and services, so that caused this domino effect. Facebook, you'll know, is also used to sign into many other apps and services, so that caused this domino effect. Francis Haugen telling a Senate hearing that Facebook's leaders know how to make their products safer, but won't because they've put their profits before people. Francis Haugen has been telling a Senate hearing that Facebook's leaders know how to make their products safer, but won't because they've put their astronomical profits before people. Rudy Giuliani, who had a physical last week, received some startling news today when his cholesterol count to be a whopping 375. <laughs> what effect this will have on the minds of the voters remains to be seen. Rudy Giuliani, who underwent a physical last week, received some startling news today when his cholesterol count turned out to be a whopping 375. <laughs> what effect this will have on the minds of the voters remains to be seen. Lava flowing from the volcano that last weekend on the Spanish island of La Palma. It has now destroyed around 200 homes. And there are fears now that when the lava hits the sea, it could create toxic gases and explosions. lava flowing from the volcano that erupted last weekend on the Spanish island of La Palma. It has now destroyed around 200 homes and there are fears now that when the lava hits the sea it could create toxic gases and explosions. Our political Chris Mason is here with me. Uh, Chris, we've had reversals of policy in the pandemic on education before. Are we likely to see another in this regard? Our political correspondent Chris Mason is here with me. Uh, Chris, we've had reversals of policy in the pandemic on education before. Are we likely to see another U-turn in this regard? All right, so the test is finished. Now it's time to score yourself. If you got questions one to three correct, you probably mastered the A1 level or beginner. If you got most questions from one to six correct, you're probably a high beginner or A2 level. If you got most questions correct between 1 and 9, you're probably a B1 or intermediate level. And if you got most questions correct between 1 and 12, you're probably a B2 level or upper intermediate. Now, if you got all of the questions correct or only missed a 1 or 2, that would probably place you at a C1 level, which is advanced. Before you go, why not share your score from the test down in the comments? We'd love to hear from you. And also, if you'd like to learn more news vocabulary, why not check out this lesson next? When something is said off the record, it means that the reporter can't consider it as official or publish it with the speaker's name attached to it. Example, the politician thought the conversation was off the record when he spoke to a reporter at a dinner party. Number seven, reporter. Reporters are a specific type of journalist who research, write, and relay the story to the public. A shocking moment on live TV this week when a reporter in West Virginia was hit by a car. It's a moment you have to see to believe. <laughs>